Electro-pneumatic Indirect Signal processing It is a little confusing? If yes, you need to learn a pneumatic circuit design. When S1 is pressed, 3 2 way DCV with spring return will shift it to the right. Compressed air directly flows through double acting cylinder and the cylinder extend. When S2 is pressed, the directional control valve will shift it to the right. Double acting cylinder and cylinder will retract. When S1 is pressed, 3 2 way DCV shifted to the right. Compressed air flow through 5 2 DCV and shifted to right. The double acting cylinder thus will extend. When S2 is pressed, 3 2 way DCV shifted to the right. Compressed air flow through 5 2 DCV and shifted to left. The double acting cylinder. Thus will retract. By pressing S1, electric circuit is closed. Solenoid 1, Y, 1 is energized. 4 2 way DCV with spring return shifted to the right. Okay. 
the piston rod of double acting cylinder, will extend. When S1 is released, the electric circuit is open. Solenoid coil, 1, Y, 1, de-energized. 4 2 way, DCV solenoid valve. Switched back to its initial position. Piston rods retract.